What's up guys, Peter Von Panda Hey, was putting together some EDC pouches for my excursions this summer. I uh, wanted to put a knife in each of these, so I picked this one up. This is a Switch Edge Stealth Camo Knife with Spring Assisted Stone Wash Blade. Actually, I don't even, not even sure what it's going to look like, but I thought we'd check it out. Uh, just was looking for inexpensive, but you know, decent little knives, something to have a blade in, in my EDC pouch. Uh, I didn't have any uh, specific needs other than just to have uh, something that can cut wood and string and tinder if I need it. You know, first of all, it has like this nylon, you know, case here. Uh, and it's kind of interesting because it's almost like a little bit of translucent, like light, you know, colored. Um, it's kind of milled and then painted with this camo graphic on the top level so kind of all these areas that are milled out here which gives it nice texture and probably makes it really easy to grip um, are kind of ground into the nylon and so they're they're kind of like this i don't know this green ivory kind of color and then on this side it's the same thing you have some holes all the way through there rivets over here you know and um, some kind of circular cuts right there so when this knife is deployed and your hands are grabbing it like this you know they're not really finger grooves per se but it should give you some nice traction and in particular up here where you've got like the serrated edge there your thumb's going to be on there to kind of brace it even if it's down here I mean this is really grippy you can see there there's like a little uh, pyramidal shaped kind of texture to everything so it is i assume it's spring assisted so we could use this to deploy it it also has a uh, bar going all the way through the blade so you could do it with the thumb here um i'm going to kind of on the uh initial open here we might take it a little slow just because they tend to be a little sometimes still a little stuck a little tight and then um oh clip right here some portholes metal clip very strong holy smokes yeah it's gonna this goes on your belt hell it may not come off your belt so there we go it does lift up put a black bar there um so let's go ahead and see if we can get this blade open obviously it has a, a couple of assists but sometimes it takes a little bit to loosen it up and there's the blade a blackened blade and it does lock into place so you have this side lock here so it holds it nice there you have a nice little pointed serrated piece right here probably about an inch and a quarter long um, those holes that pass all the way through the bar right there and then kind of a traditional curved knife blade with a nice little pointy end right up there and flat on this side so like I said you know from a size perspective I can get my whole hand on here nice big grip you know it's small enough for EDC it's probably eight or nine inches long overall um, you just Push the lock over there to slide it back here. And like I said, you could use this as like a. Got to muscle it. Nope, not gonna work. Guess you gotta loosen it up a little bit first. Couldn't quite get it there, but definitely spring assisted. I mean, to pull it out here, you've got to really use a little force, and then as soon as you kind of clear that first inch right there, boom! Now it wants to swing out. So. Once we get it loosened up, I think you could use the deployment tab there or the, the thumb tabs there if you wanted to open it up. But I think a nice little knife, not very expensive, under 10 bucks, and you know, just another one that's gonna be useful for filling out an equipment pack. Peter Von Panda, out.